Have you ever wondered how our ancient ancestors managed to traverse vast oceans and deserts without the aid of modern technology? Picture this, a world before GPS, compasses, even reliable maps, a time when the only guide was the celestial body above. Yes, we're talking about celestial navigation. In the infancy of human exploration, celestial bodies were the guiding lights, the sun, moon, stars. They served as constant, reliable markers to help early explorers find their way. Sailors, traders, and explorers from ancient civilizations like the Polynesians, Egyptians, and Greeks would gaze upwards to determine their direction and timing. Imagine a Polynesian voyager calculating his course by observing the path of the Southern Cross, or an Egyptian trader timing his journey by the cycles of the moon. These were not simple tasks, but our ancestors mastered them, creating a complex yet reliable global positioning system. So in essence, the night sky served as a complex yet reliable global positioning system for our ancestors. As civilizations evolved, so did their methods of celestial navigation. The journey from simple observation to the use of intricate tools and techniques is a fascinating tale of human ingenuity and our relentless quest to understand the universe. In the beginning, our ancestors relied on the naked eye, using the positions of the sun, moon, and stars to find their way. The North Star, for instance, served as a steadfast beacon in the night sky, guiding sailors across the vast oceans. But as our understanding of the heavens expanded, we began to develop more sophisticated tools to aid in our celestial navigation. Enter the Astrolabe. This ancient device, first used by the Greeks and later perfected by the Arabs, was a handheld model of the universe. It allowed sailors to measure the angle between a celestial body and the horizon, giving them a more accurate sense of their latitude. Following the astrolabe, the quadrant was invented in the 14th century. With this tool, navigators could measure the angle between a star and the horizon with even greater precision. The quadrant was a game-changer, fostering an era of exploration and discovery. Then came the sextant in the 18th century, a device that further refined the art of celestial navigation. With its ability to measure the angle between any two visible objects, the sextant was instrumental in charting the globe's vast oceans. Fast forward to today and we see celestial navigation playing a crucial role in something even more extraordinary, space travel. Astronauts use the stars to orient their spacecraft, much like the mariners of old. And with the universe as their ocean, they rely on these ancient methods to navigate the vast, uncharted expanse of space. Despite the advent of GPS technology, celestial navigation remains a vital skill. As we continue to explore the cosmos, the stars will always serve as our guide, a testament to the enduring wisdom of our ancestors and the infinite possibilities of our future. Even in our technologically advanced era, celestial navigation holds its relevance. It's not just a relic of the past, but a dynamic tool that continues to be utilized in modern times. It is still taught in some maritime academies around the world, serving as a vital backup method for when modern GPS systems fail. It's an old-school skill that ensures our seafarers aren't completely at the mercy of technology. But it's not just the seas where celestial navigation proves its worth. It's also vital in the vast expanse of space. Astronauts embarking on missions to the Moon and Mars use celestial navigation to plot their course and ensure they're on the right trajectory. The stars, planets, and other celestial bodies serve as reference points, guiding these brave explorers through the uncharted voids of space. So, while we may rely on satellites for our daily navigation needs, the stars still guide us in ways we often overlook. The stars have guided us for millennia, and they continue to do so even today. We've journeyed through the ages, from ancient civilizations using the stars as their compasses, charting paths across vast oceans and unexplored territories. These celestial bodies were their lighthouses in the darkness, their maps in the unknown. Fast forward to the evolution of celestial navigation, where we saw the creation of advanced tools and methods. These developments brought a new era of exploration, one marked by precision and reliability. The stars, once again, were at the center, their positions and patterns providing us with the necessary data to traverse our world and beyond. In our modern age, we find the methods of old still hold relevance, whether it's sailors using sextants at sea or space agencies directing spacecraft in the cosmos, celestial navigation remains a trusted ally. So next time you gaze up at the night sky, remember that you're looking at the same stars that guided our ancestors on their epic journeys and continue to guide us today.